Um, you could have a clip for the top suite itself for equipment rental. If, if your business um, has a lot of uh, equipment rental as part of your business, um, I've seen that on occasion. Um, but um, five of the most and four most difficult. Do you want to follow that? Because that's, that's really important. That's, this is, if you get this set up with these items, just the way I've described, you're way ahead of 90% of all people out there. I'm not a contractor, yes. so I don't understand it. It's crazy the way you would have said that you were digging on and I recommend for freight and shipping. That's a good point. A lot of people ask it. I actually create two shipping accounts. One is a shipping customer, and that will be connected to the um, income account. Uh, just just the income, or you could create if you wanted to. You didn't want it to hit because it's not really um, like construction income, or it's not part of your income. You could create a other income or a miscellaneous income if you wanted. Um, but that would connect to that, and then if you were looking for reimbursement. So if you you ordered something for a customer, you paid shipping on that, then you would uh, make that two-sided and connect that to other costs. Okay, like this one here. So on the two-sided, um, you have it connected to your main income account or a secondary one if you wanted. And then the cost side of it from UPS, whomever you put so that on the cost.